Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. If it weren't caught on camera, no one would believe it. Have you ever seen something unbelievable that no one believed was true? We bet that you regretted not taking a photo to prove it. Or maybe a friend of yours describes a certain scenario or accident and you really can't be able to picture all that in your head, thus calling their bluff. The only thing that will help you believe what your friend is telling you is if they had proof of it on a phone or the camera. Well, today we take a look at some absurd scenarios that were captured on video. Let's just say that if they weren't caught on camera, no one, including you, would have believed it. Number 10. Top Gear Crush Presenter Kim Jin Pyo took to the drag strip to pit a Chevrolet Corvette ZR1 against a vintage Bell AH-1 Cobra attack helicopter during the shooting of a 2014 episode of Top Gear Korea. It was an unusual stunt for Top Gear since they've been trying to match fast cars against flying machines over the years. But this one was ending with something of a surprise. The footage shows the Corvette defeating the ex-military AH-1 Cobra over the finish line. All seems to go well until the helicopter banks hard to the right before spiraling into the ground. Top Gear, which is known for its intense auto racing challenges, including a 1986 mini racing, a skier down a slope and checking whether a 747 jet would blow a vehicle over, is broadcast in more than 170 countries around the world, including four regional versions. Although the crash appears risky and happens close to the show's crew, the video description reads, this was an incident that was caught on camera during filming for Top Gear Korea. Luckily, no one was seriously injured. Fun fact, the Corvette ZR1 that featured in the footage has a handmade LS9 638 horsepower supercharged V8 motor and is tested in 3.4 seconds to go 0 to 60 miles per hour. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take 5 seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell, and you will get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it, it really works. Number 9. Base Jumping Goes Wrong For those afraid of heights, look away. By definition, parachuting is risky. Some states allow skydivers to fill a living will before they drop out of a perfectly good aircraft. For others, skydiving isn't a thrill enough. Those extreme few seek even higher levels of danger by taking part in jumping from base. The name itself is an acronym for the four kinds of places you can jump from. Buildings, antenna, structures, and earth. Base jumping went horribly wrong for Richard Henriksen as he tried to hang off a gymnastics bar over a cliff. Richard Henriksen attempted to make his jump while dangling from a high bar next to a cliff, but the bar broke when he tried to add an acrobatic twist to a base jumping attempt. He was thrown off a cliff when he twirled as the bar snapped. The stunt was being filmed for a Norwegian TV show called Natural Madness, and host Arsend Osen confessed that he thought Henriksen was a goner. Miraculously, Henriksen survived the fall, and in the nick of time, he opened his chute. However, he narrowly missed hitting his head on the side of the cliff, and the bar he was swinging on nearly fell on him too. Considering his close shave, Henriksen didn't realize the seriousness of his near-grave scenario until he and his five children watched the footage of his fall. Number 8. Drone Almost Hit Skier In 2015, the defending World Cup champion, Marcel Herscher, had a lucky escape after narrowly avoiding being hit by a falling drone. The 26-year-old, who won silver in the slalom at the 2014 Sochi Winter Olympics, was on his second run in a slalom World Cup race at Madonna di Campiglio in Italy when a remote-controlled drone with a mounted camera slammed into the piste inches behind him. However, he saw a funnier side of the incident later that day, writing on his Instagram page that there was heavy air traffic in Italy. Had he been a little slower, it could have been a nasty accident. Despite the close miss, he finished second, 1.25 seconds behind Henrik Kristofferson of Norway. Number 7. Surfer Attacked by Shark 
Despite winning three world surfing titles, Mick Fanning felt it wasn't enough and decided to build up his own legend in 2015 as he fought off a shark attack in the middle of a South African competition. When the shark struck, the Australian was a finalist in the J Bay Open, and the incident was captured on television. As Fanning was waiting for his first wave of the final, behind him a fin appeared. At the last moment, Fanning noticed the animal and paddled away but was dragged off his board very shortly afterwards. A wave then hid Fanning as he struggled to escape as the commentators, obviously shocked, tried to explain what was happening. Fanning would be fortunate enough to escape. Shortly, there were rescue boats nearby and he was helped ashore along with fellow finalist Julian Wilson. Subsequently, Fanning explained that his leg rope pulled him under. He reduced his schedule a bit later, admitting that the experience was an emotional, mental trauma. In 2017, he returned to a full schedule. That year, he and another surfer were pulled out of the water after another shark was seen in the same area, known for its popularity with sharks. At least the organizer spotted this one. Number 6. Rubik's Cube Challenge this next one will blow your mind. It's hard to complete the Rubik's Cube challenge in such a short time. Rubik's Cube has been a favorite puzzle around the world for 40 years. Several different methods of solving it were invented as explained in countless books. Expert speed cubers will be able to solve this in seconds. There are many fascinating mathematical questions related to the Rubik's Cube, in addition to such feats of amazing dexterity. A cube move consists of either rotating one of the six faces by 90, 180, or 270 degrees. Well, flying down to Earth in a wingsuit is an experience that few people are trained to do around the planet. And now, flyer Jeremy Allison doesn't just do it, he does it while simultaneously solving a Rubik's Cube. Turning onto his back and zooming down to the ground at 100 miles per hour, he concentrates to solve it as best as he can before he opens his parachute. And yes, he solved the Rubik's Cube before he opened his parachute. Fun fact, Felix Zemdegs is considered the fastest speed cuber on the planet, clocking 5.69 seconds, while Kevin Hayes holds the impressive distinction of having solved the most Rubik's Cubes underwater in one breath. Four-year-old Yanni Chan holds the world record for the youngest person to take part in an official competition. Number 5. Ferry Crashes Into a Crane In 2018, a roll-on, roll-off ferry crashed into a port crane while docking at Barcelona's port, causing the crane to collapse and a huge fire to sparkle. The ferry, dubbed The Excellent, was operated by Grandi Navi Velosi of Italy. The vessel was in the process of docking, according to reports, when its bow struck the crane, causing it to topple on nearby containers that quickly caught fire. Thankfully, no one was hurt in this incident. During the incident, the Excellent had 414 passengers aboard. Most were bound for Tangier, Morocco, and that evening, they were to board another vessel in GNV's fleet to continue their voyage. At the time of the accident, a storm warning for Barcelona was in effect, and the port said the accident could have been caused by high winds blowing the ferry into the dock. Number 4. Professional Drifter Driving With His Feet Have you ever come across a fella who doesn't seem to give up and has a never-die attitude? Well, meet Bartek Ostatowski. Right now, he's among Poland's best drifters, and that's nothing short of amazing. He'd been in a very horrific motorcycle crash a few years ago, and he had to amputate both of his arms. It's amazing and inspiring how he's learned to compensate, but also horribly depressing for those of us with fully functioning limbs that still can't outdrive him. Most recently, he finished in ninth place out of 50 drivers in the Polish Drift Championship, which is considered to be one of the most competitive championship series in all of Europe. Ostatowski's automobile uses an automatic 8-speed ZF gearbox, which he shifts with paddles mounted close to his right shoulder. For drifting, an e-brake is essential, so his car has a pedal-operated unit that lives just above the accelerator. He operates the gas with his right heel and the e-brake with his right toes. What? With all of this, Ostatowski is left with just his left foot to do all of the steering, but as you can see, that's not an issue whatsoever. Number 3. Aston Martin Red Bull Pit Stop Aston Martin Red Bull Racing wanted a new challenge only after conducting three record-breaking pit stops alone during the 2019 F1 season. 
They found it on board the Ilyushin 276MDK cosmonaut training plane at an altitude of 10,000 meters. Drawing on the help of Russian space agency Roscosmos, the team took the 2005 RB-1 car to Star City's Yuri Gargarian Cosmonaut Training Center and set out to prove that the sky is really the only limit by making a pit stop in zero G. The flight crew, pit crew, and cosmonaut trainers weren't the only ones packed into the Ilyushin and subjected to the ride. The production team was still on set as it rolled around the sky a role for which director Andreas Bruns trained by riding roller coasters. And with that, it's now time for today's best pick. Today's photo was sent to us by a subscriber, so if you come across a photo online and want to know more details about it, just send it over to us. We might even feature it on our future video. Number 2. Subway Model We believe this can be any one of you. Whether nodding your head to the music from your headphones while walking or checking yourself out using the restaurant windows on the streets. Anyway, this footage captured by CCTV cameras on a subway showing a sassy lady majestically walking as if she was on a runway. While she walked, she sprayed perfume in the hair without caring about the looks and glares she got from the people around her. We don't know what was going on in her head or whether she had a crush on one of the security personnel in the CCTV rooms. One thing we know for sure, she's indeed suitable to be a model. Number 1. He Long Zheng, Farmer Do you believe you have what it takes to train a chicken? Well, a 40-year-old farmer named Zhang Queen Jun walks and trains his 70,000 chickens to fly in northern China. In the clip, filmed in the city of Suiha, in the He Long Zheng province, Tens of thousands of chickens were running after the food that Sang spread out on a farm vehicle. Another video shows the chickens jumping over a ditch and flapping to get to the other side of the field. Sang said he needed to walk the chickens for about 10 kilometers a day and also train them to fly, so they'll be fit and taste better for their meat. It's a very serene sight because he has 70,000 chickens to teach and feed. So that's it. Which one from our finds was the most interesting to you, or rather, which one can you still not believe happened in real life? Are there any weird scenarios you've been able to capture using your camera? Share it with us in the comments section down below.